It really is. We talked about the season being a, potentially being a season of peaks and valleys, and you know, as we make this transition to Division One, we we know that there's going to be some ups and downs, and and uh, we wanted to make certain, if we could, to end on a high note. And we're really pleased. We finished uh, the last three games with a 2-0-1 record. The attack was uh, was strong. The defense was strong, and uh, really pleased with our effort. We continued to fight all the way through the season, and I uh, I really very very proud of our team. Yeah, when, when we uh, met with Casey this summer, she was contemplating transferring. We asked her what her strengths were and what her weaknesses were, and she talked about uh, heading was a, was a weakness of hers. She's uh, got nice height, and she's got a nice vertical leap, and she wanted to do better in the air. So it was great for her to, to score the game winner, the last game with a, with a header at the back post. Uh, you know, we're just going to continue to work. I think this team was an interesting team in that we continued to get hit with injuries. Um, we ended up with uh, eight or nine players out for the season. We, our goalkeeper, starting goalkeeper, was injured yesterday in training. She wasn't able to go, so, so Brooke came in and Brooke did a great job. Brooke worked very hard throughout the season and that's kind of how it's gone. If, uh, if a player gets injured, uh, you know, we, we, we just have to have another player ready to, uh, to come in and, and, and compete. You know, it was a, it was an interesting game. We had the 1-0 lead, and it uh, you know we honestly were kind of maybe hoping we could close it out with the 1-0, and then it goes 1-1, and then 2-1 us, and then immediately 2-2, and then we're in overtime. So it was pretty exciting from a uh, from a from a soccer perspective, and just watching the game and scoring goals, and and uh, which team's gonna can gonna be able to survive and, or get the final goal. So we were. You know, I think it was important for us to, to bend but not break a little bit, if you will, and uh, it was great for the attacking players to, to, to get, the, get the final goal and, and secure a win. Yeah, Sam played a great ball in. Uh, Sam Davis played a great ball into Allie. I mean, that's Allie, what she's done for four years. She's very pacey. She can get in behind. She's uh, got a terrific serve, so it was really great for, for Allie to, to, to uh, be able to get in behind, get a nice touch, serve the ball to Casey at the back post, and, uh, and Casey to, to have the game winner. Again, Allie's kind of done that for four years. Whether we're Division One or Division Two, Allie's got tremendous speed, and and she can she can uh, she has the ability to run in behind um, virtually any team that we've played. So uh, we're obviously we're going to miss her pace and speed up front. Uh, Megan Fry, it was a terrific uh, second goal. We're pleased for Megan that as a senior she goes out on a high note. Uh, had a nice goal. She's had a wonderful career, and uh, it was great for Megan to uh, to get on the board as well in, in her final in her final game. She uh, strikes the ball exceptionally well. She's got a very powerful left foot, so we're, we're uh, really proud of Megan. Uh, uh.